Come on. There we go. Alright. Dear Diary. Wow! What an incredible end to an amazing adventure. I outwitted the evil pirate with Chuck, crossed an avalanche, kinda, and lived to tell the tale. But, uh... Even better, Elaine and I finally got married. Yeah. And all of our friends were there too. It's extra I creaky. It's never been happier. And now all we have to do is set a course and get our honeymoon. Sailing on the Sea of Thieves. To get there, we have to pass through the Devil's Shroud. And Elaine says it's no big deal so long as we follow the map, but I don't know. I miss seeing the stars. Have the nightmare again. I wake up in our cabin. Elaine is gone. And at the end of my bed, look, Chuck is there, laughing at me. It's crazy, I know. I left him buried back on Monkey Island, but why does it feel so real? I can almost hear the laughter. So I should be able to go back to the same checkpoint. When I did get back to sleep, I had a very different dream. I was back where it all began, on my quest to become a legendary pirate. Back at the start of my very first adventure. It's going a little faster. Okay. Rotate it it's here. Let's see how I do. My progress not say no. It
second. Dude. Gold's no good to me. If you want to buy something, you need to cough up pieces of eight. Preferably not literally. Hey, uh, that transaction has been concluded. Oh. I got my cargo. You get your chance to schmooze with the legend of Monkey Island. Okay. Everything else will cost you. If you see something you like. Nope. The Tri Island Chamber of Commerce specifically banned gold based transactions in case cursed currency somehow makes its way into the ecosystem. I heard there was this one ship where the crew. It, well, anyway, only authentic silver pieces are eight, a legal tender on Melee Island. Gold's no good to me. What parrot? Okay. Hey now, supplies of the Legend of Monkey Island figurine set are still limited. So there's a long waiting list, and your name is not even on it. Hands off. That's fresh stock. A history book detailing the proud her- Alright, anyways. Okay, so... How much? Wait just a second. By order of the governor, mischievous potions and all forms of mojo magic are now banned here on Melee Island. That means this shop is permanently closed for business. Get it? Now move along. And where do you think you're going? Oh, yeah? Let me, uh, seems genuine. Funny, I thought we'd gotten rid. Uh, well, only one thing for it. There, I booked you in for the next available session. Come back and speak to my colleague after the clock strikes midnight. <laughs> like that'll happen anytime soon. That clock tower hasn't worked in years. Sounds like I have to go fix the clock. No, that's the other side of this archway. Yeah. This was to get up there or something. I don't know how you tell how much how many pieces of eight you have.
something hilarious? There's a pack of piranha poodles in this alley that can't stand the sound of this thing. Watch. What's the matter? Can't you reach your lovely booty business? Alright, that's enough, you mangy mutts. Go lay down. I said that's enough! We guard the governor now, not you pathetic pooches. So get used to it! Now move along and don't start any trouble. I'm on break. Why? Hey, get your own snacks, you demon pirate wannabe. Those will burn a hole in your tongue. Hey, get your own snacks, you demon pirate wannabe. Those will burn a hole in your tongue. Did I miss my chance to steal from them? Oh, wait. Ow. Are you a visitor? It's been so long since I've had anyone but Captain Coco to talk to. Oh, there was a little misunderstanding after I came back from Monkey Island. I came in a little too fast and smashed up the jetty pretty bad. But it wasn't my fault! You ever tried to sail a galleon crewed entirely by monkeys? They emptied out my bananas, ran off, and left me to take the blame! Sure have, but it's okay. I'm good friends with the legend of Monkey Island. I was even on his crew once. I'm sure he'll be along to let me out just as soon as he's finished his important, uh, you know, governor stuff. Yep, any time now. And it's not like I'm alone this time. Captain Coco and I keep one another company. If he didn't have me to talk to, he'd have lost his mind by now. Where? Oh, no, <laughs> that's Captain Coco. He was my first mate on our journey back from Monkey Island. Say hello, Captain Coco. Hello. Oh, it's simple. Captain Coco and I met back when I was stranded. Our monkey crew didn't trust me back then, so he was my only friend. 
And we've been inseparable ever since. Hey, I don't know how it is where you come from, but eating your shipmates is not okay. I'd sooner go back to snacking on rats. That would be great. But I don't know how you would. The sheriff has all the keys, and I haven't seen him since the governor's guards moved in. I don't know, Otis. Those locks look pretty rusty. I bet you could blow them wide open. That is a great idea. Captain Coco, you are a certified genius. Oh, shucks. You say the nicest things. Good luck. Um, something smoke inside. Are you a visitor? That would be great! I don't know, Otis. Those locks look pretty rusty. I bet you could blow them wide... Blow them wide open. And where do you think you <laughs> Yeah, you and the governor's mansion is off limits to anyone who hasn't got enough. If you can't show me something to prove you're expected, you can turn right back.
Get your own snacks, you <laughs> thieving pirate wannabe. Those will burn a hole in your tongue. Uh oh. No. This feels like I'm supposed to be this way. I'm, I'm going too far right. That even matters. But I don't think I'm supposed to get up here. What's we doing? <laughs> uh, it seems like I'm supposed to be going up there. alleyway. Not too glamorous, but I guess they have their uses. This one seems oddly mysterious. Yes, I know it does. I know it seems mysterious. Empty dog food bowl that must be starving. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. 
I don't think so, stranger. You say, well, it's that map shop no more, and that means it's off limits to the... Ah. Since I don't see no uniform, and you also look like you're alive, I'm thinking that means you ain't exactly a guard. So sing your hook! Let me guess. Another pirate wannabe looking for easy answers. Well, let me tell you something. We love pirate wannabes looking for easy answers. <laughs> I highly doubt it. The governor hired a man to wind the mechanism, but most days he falls asleep in the scum bar and forgets. He's going to lose the clock tower key one of these days, and then... Well, I suppose not much will actually change around here. It's always grog o'clock. Try that again, and you'll be joining the devil for supper. Leave me be. I'm... So they're sleeping. Who else is sleeping? How do you... What am I missing here? can't interact with them. What 
business do you have with us now? Speak up, be quick about it. Aye, that they be. They've got their own pirate lord nowadays. Uh, I told you not to use his name. It gives me a... You'll have to forgive Murray. He and the... Missing? It was an act of theft and wanton dismemberment. And one day, I shall exact my dim... Of course, these gullible fools may think of him as a legend. But I am not deceived. I have spent years plotting my retribution. However, the customers and I have formed an eternal bond. They will never let me leave, not unless someone can provide a replacement. Uh, what does that mean? What be ye wanting? Gosh. Um, I assume you mean pieces of eight. That's the currency. The cook could have been persuaded to take you on, but he's already hired himself a new Well, I'm sure if you keep your eyes peeled. You... Of course, a real pirate would notice more nefarious opportunities to fill. Now that's the sort of question I'd expect from a pirate wannabe. May granted, more than a few folks have retired from a life on the high seas and taken up other lines of work where they can. But pretty much everyone you'll rub shoulders. Oh, I shouldn't. Governor Threepwood is in charge now. And there's the days of being clapped in irons by the local sheriff for long gone. And it's all... Back again? You're persistent, I'll give you that. Back so soon. You've plenty of questions, I'll be bound. Uh... Hey, you leave that skull alone. He's got a job to do. business do you have with us now? Speak up and be quick about it. I am no mere decoration. We are the esteemed skulls of- Aye, this be a place so foul. Even the- And half the customers will run you through just for the fun of it. What's- In all my centuries, I've never found a better place to hang my head. <laughs> Excuse me. I've got something in my eye hole. Oh, don't you dare start blubbering. You can be st <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't know. <laughs> okay.
Hello, hello. Hey, hey, get your sticky fingers Oops. off my money. Don't think I don't see you. Yikes. Don't sneak up on me like that. My job, that's what. I'm the official lookout of Melee Island, appointed by Governor Squinky Thriftweed himself. It's my job to keep an eye out for storms, incoming ships, and so on, and report them directly to the governor. <laughs> Your ship. No offense, but that's barely a rowboat compared to the sort of ships made famous by the legend of Monkey Island, the Sea Monkey. Well, now, that was a ship worth talking about. A fearless crew, a gallant captain, and the largest cereal supply you've ever seen. You what? A ship, you say? Ooh, this could be serious. Well, whoever it was, they're gone now. Guess I'll keep my eyes open. Stole your money, old man. <coughs> Ooh, sneezed. Yikes! Don't sneak up on me like that. Eh, I don't so much care for chatting with the folks in town. Most of them just sit around telling tales. I just as soon tend them a fire and stay out of trouble. All right, if you're looking for excitement, here's a little free advice, though, chum. Stay out of the way of the governor's guards. No, 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 I'm old. All right. Uh... It didn't get me... I mean, I stole his money, but... Oh, oh, okay. That's it? Okay, so I have that still. Do I fish for some food? Oh, I can't even. Oh, wait.
me see if this dog reacts to fish. Wait a second. I don't remember seeing that before. Hold on, let me see what this dog. Probation. Come to share a table with me. Come to share a table with me. Hands off. That key's for official town business only. What are you looking at me for? I think you just did. So what brings you to my... Oh, I bet I can guess who. Oh, well, too bad for you. The governor is a busy fellow. You could try and make an appointment with... This is actually a quiet night. Business is booming. Most days you cannot move for people telling stories, singing. <laughs> Listen, if I get started, we will be here for hours. All the crews come from all across the Caribbean. Just thought if you want to know more. There is a guy selling books in town. <laughs> but you'll need more pieces of eight than most folks. Hmm, this does not sound like somewhere I have been. I mostly stick to the Tri Island area. Been. Well, almost everywhere. They say you cannot get to Monkey Island just by charting a course. Unless, me. I would say you probably hit your head on... It does not matter where you're from. Nobody here will respect you unless the governor respects you. A drink? Well, you could wait for the cook to notice you, but that could take all day. He has been rushed off his feet ever since word got out about the legend of Monkey Island and these pirate wannabes started. He is convinced if he can find the right combination of ingredients, he can create... Well, I heard he'd hired an assistant, but... Then... Anyway, if you want grog, just find a mug and sneak into the kitchen. That is what we all do. I think you... No, no. Kitchen staff only. Come on, man. What was I supposed to get again? Hey, you shouldn't be back here. Because it's the rules, that's why. Customers stay out front where they can't mess everything. Oh, um, right. Well, I guess I want something fiery and hard. Too bad I'm still missing. Meat stew. 
when I can find the time to spice the meat, chop the veg, and add the special ingredient. Sure enough, the lady from the mojo shop stopped by before the governor's guards closed her down with a box of root beer sprinkles. She told me to add them to the grog and anything I cook to provide us all. Don't know why, but I hate to see good grub go to waste. Can't help you there. I've just hired a new... Don't know what the delay is all about, but I hope they remember to pick up their uniform from the general store. I've had it Of course it matters. Cooking's a messy business, and you need to look the part. As soon as they arrive, I'm going... Yeah, in the barrel. But don't think you can just go helping yourself. I got a batch of it in stock in case the legend of Monkey Island ever stops. But you need a strong stomach for the stuff, or he'll be... been playing for 50 minutes and I might as well have just started playing. I haven't gotten anywhere. You lost? Oh, then you come to the right pirates. We know pretty much everything that happens here on Melee Island. <sniffs> At this time of night, well, probably the only place with an open kit. The chef's a real stickler for the rules. If you're not the new assistant cook he's hired, you aren't getting out. Well, you could try begging a gunpowder gummy off of one of the governor's guards, but it might be the last thing you ever chew. <laughs> Ah, out by the island lookout, no question. There's a pathway that leads to it. If the weather weren't so strange lately, you'd be able to see all the way across the island. Not much reason to head up there, though. Unless you're planning to swindle a few pieces of eight out of the lookout. I did that. Yeah, then you're in luck. A ship full of valuables went down in the harbor here not so long ago. Of course, even if you could find a way to raise its cargo up out of the water, you'd... some parts of the town are still being renovated. <laughs> oh, those poor... <laughs> I can't help it. There's just some... <laughs> I can't help it. There's... <laughs> the governor's guard dogs get tormented by the guards, you see. 
They've lost all the fire in their... I bet if they scarfed down a hearty meal, they'd soon be back to their nasty old... <laughs> of course we do. My favorite is the old top-up trick. What you do, see, you wait for your shipmate to get distracted. Then you pour some grog from your tankard into theirs without them catching you. They'll be snoring before you know it. <laughs> yeah, I... I... Trying to get well, the grog. I mean, yes. Another pirate wannabe looking for e <laughs> Of course we are. Salty old pirates through and through. But on Malay Island, that's to be expected. Most folk now, the really rotten apples, they get taken to the town jail. <laughs> that old place has seen better days, though. They say the governor hired someone to fix up the place. Last. I feel like if I could just get one thing to happen, it can start unraveling. I haven't been able to do a single thing, though. That's the church, though. Like, I can't, n nothing's happening. Anyway, not too glamorous, but I guess they have their uses. Yeah, I, I... I 
What am I missing? I can't. Are you a visitor? That would be great! But I don't know how you would. The sheriff has all the keys. I don't know, Otis. Those locks look pretty rusty. I bet you could blow them wide open. That is a great idea. Gap oh, shucks. You say good luck. That would be great. I say? don't know, Otis. That is a great idea. Oh, shucks. You Thanks. say good luck. Where, how? Is there a crouch button in this game? Am I missing something? Too much trouble, and you might end up in prison. There's not much to do here except count the rats. My pal Otis seems to spend a lot of time stuck down here. How do you... How do you cause too much trouble? He doesn't even care. And where do you think you're going? Oh, yeah? Uh, there. can't start things on fire. I can't hit or blow things up.
Okay. Well. Keep your hands off the display cases. I just polished them. Well, money's still money, no. Besides, leaving your store unattended. You have no idea how many swords, shovels, and other nautical accessories I had. Go Now, there was a time when I might have taken a moonlight stroll. Wait, wait. That's nobody else's business. Groups! That's the mighty pirate sword used by the legend of Monkey Island. Well, it's a, a deluxe handmade. I got some fresh stock coming in. The only general store on Melee Island. The storekeeper gets a little paranoid around pirates. Then again, I did kind of break into his safe once. Maybe... Those are fuses. You just put one end in something explosive, you set fire to the other end, and you put your fingers in your ears. Try not to blow your skin. Alright, we're on to something. If I didn't see him in the window... Finally decided to show up, huh? Yeah, you Well, you can make bastard. yourself useful and start on the meat stew. The recipe's on the table. I'm going on my break. Don't let the customers touch anything. Especially not the grog. Yeah, I already did that on my own.
hands off. That key's for official town business only. My gosh, I'm so drunk. Let me take a seat and do this. Hold on. Drink up, Scotty. And you keep drinking. Keep up. Drink up. latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure, with an, not to mention the detailed and sorry, but on some topics I just get carried away. <laughs> I... Keep going there, buddy. Mm-hmm. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh wait, no, I got that key.
Uh, midnight, right? I'm gonna go get that hunk of meat. Assuming that's what I put in that dog wolf. <clears throat> that's a cute stuffed toy modeled after the free headed monkey of Monkey Island. Very popular with kids and animals. I don't know how much. Oh. Hey, I told you not to start trouble. Get back in your cage. Gummies <laughs> for the whole of you. Oh. 
stick his head somewhere. Oh no. Oh no. Oh crap. Do I just F this up? Why did it let me do that? Ahoy there, fancy pants. Those are fuses. You just put one end in something explosive, you set fire to the other end, and you put... Silly, but we can start over, build new lives for ourselves. Like running a furniture store. Hey, enough with the furniture store. I didn't spend all that time locked up just to collect chairs. I want to have an adventure. And I want to sell nested mahogany tables at affordable prices. Hey. Where are you going, dude? Whoa.
And where do you think... Oh, yeah? Uh, seems just... <laughs> there. I booked you in for the next available session. Come... What the... Uh... Well, the, the, the thing is... It's, uh... Uh, shift change. Yeah, that's right, shift change. I can't let you through, because then my colleague, who is unfortunately delayed, would take the blame if anything happened. See? Sorry, but until my replacement arrives for an official handover... Keep your hands off the display cases. I well, all my wares are right here on display, save for the reserve stuff. Feel free to browse. You don't suppose correctly. I deal in pieces of eight. And before you ask, no, I don't offer credit. Nice try. But I... I know what I gotta do. I gotta find those dogs. Get that guy's head. Dogs go. Interesting.
Alright, so I know what I gotta do. I gotta find those dogs and get that skull. And then I could take that other skull, probably. Alright. Uh, yeah, I'll leave it off.